Welcome, explorers of the unknown. Today, we set out on a quest to explore the mysteries shrouding the towering giant, the majestic Mount Everest. In the heart of the Himalayas, where the heavens kiss the earth, Mount Everest stands as the pinnacle of nature's grandeur and human determination. Rising majestically to an awe-inspiring height of 29,032 feet, this towering giant is not merely a geological formation, it's a symbol of mankind's relentless pursuit of the extraordinary. In this narrative, we embark on a thrilling journey through the history, challenges, triumphs, and tragic incidents that have marked the conquest of Mount Everest. The quest to conquer Everest commenced in earnest in the 1920s. The British launched a series of expeditions, with notable attempts in 1921, 1922, and 1924. The latter marked the tragic loss of George Mallory and Andrew Irvine, whose disappearance on the mountain added an enduring mystery to Everest's lore. Did they reach the summit before tragedy struck? The question lingered for decades, fueling the fervor for Everest conquest. It wasn't until 1953 that Everest finally yielded to human determination. Sir Edmund Hillary of New Zealand and Tenzing Norgay, a Sherpa of Nepal, etched their names in history as the first to summit the world's highest peak. Their ascent under the leadership of Colonel John Hunt marked a watershed moment in mountaineering history, a testament to the indomitable spirit of mankind. Yet, triumph was accompanied by tragedy. The ascent claimed lives, and the thin air, frigid temperatures, and treacherous conditions continue to exact a toll on climbers to this day. Everest is both conqueror and conquerable, a dichotomy that amplifies its mystique. The journey to the summit of Mount Everest is a compelling narrative of triumph, tragedy, and the relentless pursuit of a seemingly insurmountable goal. As climbers approach Everest Base Camp, they enter a world where the air is thin, and the landscape is dominated by the icy grandeur of the Kumbu Glacier. The base camp serves as a crucial hub for acclimatization, where climbers adjust to the high altitude conditions that can prove fatal if not respected. However, the ascent of Everest is not without its perils. The notorious Kumbu Icefall, a treacherous labyrinth of towering ice seracs and crevasses, poses a formidable challenge early in the climb. Over the years, Climbers have faced heart-stopping moments as massive blocks of ice have calved, sending avalanches thundering through the icefall. The danger is palpable, underscoring the delicate balance between conquering nature and succumbing to its raw power. The Western Coombe, a vast, bowl-shaped glacial valley, awaits climbers beyond the icefall. Here, the thin air and intense sunlight reflect off the ice, creating an otherworldly landscape that tests the limits of human endurance. Climbers must navigate the Lode Sea face, a steep ice wall, as they ascend toward the South Call, a critical campsite in the Death Zone, where oxygen levels are dangerously low. The Death Zone, beginning at around 26,247 feet, is a realm where the human body's ability to function deteriorates rapidly. Climbers here face the constant threat of altitude sickness, frostbite, and exhaustion. The thin air amplifies the challenges, making even the simplest tasks a monumental effort. In this unforgiving environment, the line between success and tragedy becomes razor thin. Tragedy has indeed befallen many on Everest. The mountain's unforgiving nature was vividly illustrated in 1996 when a sudden storm struck, trapping climbers on the summit and in the death zone. John Krakauer's best-selling book, Into Thin Air, chronicled the harrowing events of that fateful day, providing a gripping account of the resilience and fragility of the human spirit when faced with the wrath of nature. In the years that followed, Everest has witnessed both triumph and heartbreak. The 2015 earthquake in Nepal triggered a catastrophic avalanche on Everest, claiming the lives of 22 climbers and Sherpas. The incident sparked renewed debates about the commercialization of Everest and the ethical responsibility of mountaineers and expedition organizers. Yet, amidst the challenges and controversies, Everest continues to draw adventurers like moths to a flame. The allure of standing on the world's highest point, 
where the earth meets the sky, remains an irresistible call. The climbing community has evolved, with advances in technology, safety measures, and environmental consciousness shaping the modern Everest experience. In recent years, climbers have embraced new routes, such as the challenging West Ridge and the technically demanding Hornby and Colwar, adding fresh excitement to Everest expeditions. The introduction of advanced weather forecasting and communication technologies has enhanced safety and decision-making, but the mountain's capricious nature ensures that success is never guaranteed. In conclusion, Mount Everest is more than a geographical marvel, it is a symbol of humanity's unyielding spirit in the face of adversity. The mountain's majesty is matched only by the challenges it presents, and every climber who dares to ascend its slopes becomes part of an enduring saga that transcends time. As Everest continues to cast its formidable shadow over the world of mountaineering, the allure of its summit remains an irresistible call to those who seek to conquer the roof of the world. Thank you for joining us on this thrilling expedition. If you enjoyed our Everest adventure, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more epic journeys into the heart of the world's wonders. Until next time, stay adventurous.